everybody. Oh, sorry. I don't know why I had the giggles with that. You're excited about who it's going to be. Oh, well, no. Uh, All right. Sorry to be to kill your vibe. It's fine. <laughs> okay, I'm ready to go. <laughs> what the fuck? It's going to be fun. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Bases Loaded. I'm Scott Ashley Smith alongside here with uh, Kristen Stewart and she's come all the way from filming Twilight the 34th. This is uh, Moondoggy and I love it. I can't wait. It's a remake of the old Gidget films. Wow. So older people will get that one. With the Twilight films, the yes. younger generation gets that. We have so older people watching Gotta the get the demo. Gotta get the demo. That's why Kirsten Stewart has decided to come. Case Stu. Sit next to me. Case Stu. Winning like Case Stu is here in Winning the, like the SAS Studios like City. And uh, Taylor Lautner is right off to the side because um, we said no no A minus listers here. No. Only C's. And, and I mean by the boobs. I don't know if we said that. C but cups. Okay. C cups. All right, so we're going to be talking about the Anaheim Angels of Minnesota. <laughs> you mean the Los Angeles. Oh, they play there? Angels of Anaheim County or something like that. Ooh. Oh, no, of Orange County. Of Orange County. They're the OC. The, yeah, they're the real housewives of OC. Yes. So we're going to start talking. So Tamara and Vicky are getting along this season. So far. So, so, far. so far. And they're, right now, they're really upset because one of the housewives, Josh Hamilton, has moved out to Texas. He gone. He gone. Grab some pine meat. So tell us about <laughs> that. Yes, Hamilton has left. The building. And they could use them right about now because their lineup is very, very not good. Sorry, we Pools probably misses his cocaine buddy. Well, <laughs> maybe. Uh, Pools uh, isn't hitting that well. He's got a, got some home runs, but not getting on base. Those, legalize those roids. Legalize those roids. Uh, he either stopped or he's not taking them correctly. One of the two. I'm not sure. He's got anisins. <laughs> I don't even know what that is, but it sounds bad. Headache pain medicine. Oh. How's that going to help okay, you? I'll run? leave. I don't know. Oh. Well, you should tell him. I will. You should write a letter. I'm going to tweet him. Fan melon. Fan melon. Yeah. Oh, I tweet them now. They Nobody have fans does fan down mail. there. Do they fan don't they have? Don't they have a horrible fan base? That's what Hamilton said. Wow. I, I, That's just what I was told. I don't have the inside connection. I went there. Josh I Hamilton think, like you do. So I, I think they they have a good fan base, and I like their stadium. It's actually. a beautiful stadium, right by Disneyland. Who doesn't love that? I love it. I love it. And that's. I'm Probably one it. of the only positives of the Angels this season. Oh. Um, yeah, I know. They don't have much I think on. it's kind of cool because you know how they have all those rocks out there and in, in, in yeah, outfield yeah, fences? Yeah, yeah. And like then a, a, few of them, a few of them around in the infield and outfield. Yeah. They have some rocks. Yeah. Good fan, something to look at. Yeah. So, yes. Um, yeah, you know, weak uh, lineup, but the one bright spot, I will mention, they do have a bright spot. Your boy. What? Jeff Weaver, or Jared Weaver. Jared Weaver. <laughs> Je Jeff Weaver. <laughs> uh, went 4-0 in the month of May. That's good. With a 1.96 ERA. Because he couldn't get himself out of a paper sack. But in the month of May he could? In the month of April. But in the month of May, he, of May. he was like, give me a plastic bag. Yeah. So they have... about the environment. You know, he, you know, he's not a big environment. But, but they have Weaver on a hot streak right now. They got Houston Street at the back of the bullpen. And those are the only positive things I could find about your angels of Los Angeles, of Anaheim, of Orange County. Yeah. Um, the irony is, though, they are in second place. It's a weak division. What do you think? It is a weak division. And teams are underachieving. So, so tides will be Tides will changing. turn. You know. Do they have any future prospects that could come and save the day? Uh, you know what? I actually looked at their prospects earlier today, and you know how many I found? How many? I did not find one. I hear they don't have a farm system. They actually have an <laughs> organic farm. That I believe. <laughs> they just, they're just cultivating out there yes. tomatoes and cucumbers and what they do is they trade like a farmer's market to a team oh. which is weird you know what people like farmers market they do and i could see the giants that's a doing big the trade the very that's a big draw. Very i know a lot of people vegan. who would watch that over the game yeah well have you seen the ratings down there Rating oh i was talking about the that's the dodgers we're not there yet, uh, not yet. their ratings are horrid what? um so that's pretty much it about the houston i mean about the i want to talk about houston <laughs> again because <laughs> anaheim, wow. anaheim of, yes um, the mighty ducks nobody's coming up Hamilton's gone. Pujols is only declining. Mike Trout, still Mike Trout. But they only let him bat once every nine guys. That's ridiculous. It's a bad rule. It's got to change. It's a bad it's rule. It's got to change. Throw it out. I'm Scott Ashley Smith uh, alongside Michael Cezina. 
This has been bases loaded. Um, the uh, Angels edition. Angel style. I don't know where they are. Um, they're still in Anaheim. Disneyland edition. I like it. So long, everybody. And um, someone out there, give my best to marry him. Goodbye. Goodbye.